European champions against the beaten finalists of two years ago. Europe's is Andres Iniesta for Barcelona. Neymar on the move, so is Suarez. A the space here for Messi. And Messi's going to try one for the first time tonight. And just drag it wide. It would be a significant goal if Messi scores tonight. He's one away from 500 in the career, which is a remarkable tally at 28. Yeah, good play by Barcelona. Great move from Neymar. Tees Messi up, just pulls his shot slightly on his left foot, closed down quickly. What a dangerous break by Barcelona because they were hunted down by Atletico. But those Atletico Madrid players took back into uh, very solid defensive positions. Neymar looking to accelerate away, and he manages to find his way through. And then uh, Juan Fran got a challenge in. Here's Messi. Well, you don't often see him miss from that kind of range by that much. Not at all, not when it's on his left foot as well, Flex. That was a big moment because they need something to really ignite this game and get the crowd on side. Neymar as well, but a lovely flow to both the far post by Jordi Alba. And you don't expect that at all. Way wide. Way wide by Lionel Messi. Nice on the volley. Well, Neymar. Occupying that left-hand side for Barcelona. Now Messi. Dani Alves. In towards Neymar, what an opportunity. You would have expected Neymar to gobble that one up. And Neymar expected Neymar to gobble that up by his reaction. Best chance of the match and he should have buried it. He's good with his head. Lovely ball by Dani Alves. Flipped in, Neymar meets it perfectly well. Should have bustled in the net. Not too high. Good power. Didn't trouble Oblak at all. He knows. HD. And at the same time, Wolfsburg against Real Madrid. That's some BT Sport 2 HD. Again from seven. And there's the first shot that's sent in. Never worry in Ter Stegen. Now Carrasco. Griezmann, certainly the player in form for Atletico Madrid. He scored in the last six league matches. He's the top scorer with 26 goals, the French international. Now Coque, here's Fernando Torres! And Torres punishes Barcelona! And the excellent start made by Atletico Madrid is rewarded by the first goal. Yeah, you know what, it's brilliant play by Atletico Madrid. Real poor defensive play by Barcelona, completely switched off. No. Nobody, nobody following Fernando Torres, but the quick passing from Atletico Madrid was excellent. It's the first goal that Torres has scored in the Champions League since 2014, when he scored for Chelsea against Atletico Madrid, and it's ele his 11th goal against Barcelona. Yeah, they really slowed the game down. It's two quick passes, and then it was... Coke into Fernando Torres, and what on earth is the defence is doing here? Look, PK goes and closes, Mascherano and Dani Alves are all over the place. The gap, look how big that gap is, Fernando Torres, to make, make a nice little run into it. Lovely flip pass by Coke, and Fernando Torres just smashes it in through the legs of Ter Stegen. It's only Torres' the seventh goal of the season. He's uh, much happier back at Atletico Madrid. It didn't quite work for him at Chelsea. And then Torres with a good ball here towards Griezmann. And it took a good save in the end, didn't it, from Ter Stegen to get down and turn it round the post. It took an excellent save from Ter Stegen. You see, Luis Enrique told on the subs to warm up. I don't know whether Jordi Alba's struggling. But again, defensively, they got caught out. One step forward, Mascherano. Jordi Alba stepped back. Griezmann gets a good effort. It's a good, good hand by Ter Stegen to push it wide. Great to see what Luis Enrique is going to do, or what the players are going to do. How are they going to rectify this? Oh, no, no. we're going to get a change in the tie because Fernando Torres has been shown a yellow card already. There's a second yellow and a red, and the man who scored the goal for Atletico Madrid is sent off after 35 minutes. And Diego Simeone can't believe it. Well, it looked like an accident. It looked as if he tripped over his own feet. Here we go. 
Oh, Less than five minutes to go in the first half. The first half where uh, Jan Oblak of Atletico Madrid is yet to make a significant save. Uh, that's probably the first that day enough to pit Barcelona to the championship. It's actually ten years since they won here. And Fernando Torres, lovely ball. The second good chance that has been created by Atletico Madrid in this second half. Here's Iniesta, now Neymar. And then Messi! Well, that was lovely, wasn't it? That was more like it. And regardless of it going wide, it was really nice play. Iniesta to Neymar, who fronts one fan up and flips in a lovely ball to Messi. And all he can do is this. Nice chest control, overhead kick, connects with it really well. Just half a yard wide. In the past ten years, we've seen them nestle into the bottom of the net. This one, just wide. And there's the ball from the Carrasco. It was a beaut, wasn't it? To win it back. They got there ahead of Felipe Luiz. And now Lionel Messi, Griezmann back there for Atletico Madrid. Andres Iniesta, Neymar. Still Neymar. Oh! And then Danny Alves and will get another opportunity. In towards Neymar again, who goes down in the referee being champions. And that will certainly just uh, reinvigorate them and reinvigorate the supporters too. This is the Neymar chance. Yeah, this surprised me really because one fan lets him come back inside, doesn't he? And that just opens up the whole picture. And Augusto Fernandez with his first defensive work to block the shot. Rakitic again. In towards Neymar! Another header. And a save this time from Oblak. Should have scored. Wasn't a difficult header. Heads it right to the goalkeeper. Right at the goalkeeper. It's coming onto the ball. Could, should have went back across the goalkeeper. To the goalkeeper's left into that far corner. That's his reaction. He was the defender in the right place at the right time on this occasion. Now Mascherano. Lionel Messi, and still Lionel Messi, or oh, black down, Neymar on the follow-up. And it was Juan Fran who got a foot in for Atletico Madrid. Dangerous business letting him come onto his left foot. Poor by Griezmann in the end. As Busquets, Neymar. Neymar with a curler, he's getting closer isn't he? Again, Atletico letting him come inside onto his right foot. Something they didn't do in the first half. They want him to go left down towards the, the touch line. As soon as you let Neymar or Messi come inside on their favourite foot, they can do this. And that is very, very close. You have to show him. He's uh, almost playing as an out-and-out an -out left winger in the second half. There's hardly any defending for Barcelona to do. Now Neymar, Alba. Iniesta, Neymar lines up another one, gives it instead to Messi. Dani Alves, in towards Jordi Alba, and off Suarez, and the European champions are level, and Luis Suarez has another one, just when they needed it most. He hasn't done much all night, but wow, has he ignited the crowd at the new Camp. <laughs> Disappointing, frustrating night for Luis Suarez, but he continues to put himself in the right positions all the time, just in case. Seven goals in eight matches gets his reward tonight. Lovely ball by Danny Alves, Jordi Alba stalking at the far post, pulls his shot, but pulls it to the best man on... The best man who can finish in a Barcelona side is Luis Suarez, and as I said, he's in the right areas just in case that happens. He was on side. Luis Suarez. Here's Iniesta, and now Neymar. They're coming forward for a second one here. Lovely feet by the Brazilian. And then Neymar, and then Suarez. And behind, and they've made a change, Barcelona at the World Cup. That's taken a long time yeah. to uh, get over. He certainly plays on the edge, doesn't he, as we've seen. In a couple of K. 
in by Dani Alves towards Neymar. It was uh, Juan Fran with the right back in there to clear it. Just gets forced to hurry, still gets it to Messi, and then Suarez, and then Alves, and then Suarez! Fantastic from Barcelona! A quality goal from the best side in Europe. And it's in the back of the net in the blink of an eye, wasn't it? It all happened so, so quickly. That's where they want to be. They've got the noses in front now. Quick, quick play. Messi into Suarez. Knocks it wide to Danny Elvis. Pings it in, and that's a great header. Great finish. See what Godin thinks about it. It's just behind him. Can't get his body shape in the right way, but Luis Suarez can. And he is onto it, and bang! Flies past Old Black. Not a huge amount of power, but he generated it from his header. Chance here for Barcelona. Neymar, Partey with a challenge. And the referee blows the full-time whistle. And Barcelona do have the lead after a tough 90 minutes in the new Camp tonight. Suarez with two goals in the second half. His 44th and 45th goal of the season. Now the game turned, though, on that red card for Fernando Torres after 35 minutes, six minutes after he'd given Atletico Madrid the lead in the new Camp. It's advantage Barcelona, but there's work to do for the European champions in eight days' time in the Calderon. Full-time in the new Camp tonight. Barcelona 2, Atletico Madrid 1. What a fabulously entertaining game of football and a wonderful second-half performance from Barcelona against the ten men of Atletico de Madrid. And how delightfully balanced the second leg is for a week tomorrow, live, of course, on BT Sport. Neymar there went close on a number of occasions, but it was Luis Suarez who ended up the hero of the night, but should he have been on the pitch to score those two goals? Uh, there's so much discussed, but um, overall a thoroughly entertaining game we have. Yeah, it's finally balanced now for the second leg, and I think Atletico Madrid will be the happier team walking off the pitch. I think you can see there the pictures before Tad had disappointed the Barcelona players because leaving the pitch there at home, winning 2-1, Atletico Madrid have to win 1-0 at home to go through. The one, the one difference, though, is that... It